Hey guys, it's Erica. We are going to be checking out Drippin's villain choreography music video. I don't know what's wrong with me. I can't talk today. I legitimately can't talk. So all my reactions are bad today. So I apologize ahead of time for this one. And I'm out of breath too. I don't know. Do I need to do more cardio? Um, but I'm very excited to be checking this out. I really like the song. I really like this comeback. And I was liking the choreography that they did show in the music video. But I was like a little bit distracted by what was happening in the music video to fully focus on the choreography. So that's what this is for. And I am very, very excited to be checking it out. Especially because that one, the fire in front of the diner where they're dancing was so sick. And I loved it. They also had another location that was really, really nice too as well. Inside like an art museum type thing um but i'm just very excited to be channel this choreography i love this comeback from them i think it's probably my favorite that they have done um so yeah so you know with it let go oh they kept the woolam intro okay i mean just copy and paste it okay the very Nice. Overall, I like the vibe so far. Is it just gonna be in this set and not the other one that I like? That's fine. I like how it's not super sharp. Oh no, they didn't cut to it. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna be so sad. The moves are almost like bouncy, which works for this song. And I do like how they are showing more of this set versus this one. Unless I'm speaking too soon. Because the music video, we didn't get a whole lot of the. It. it was mainly that stuff that they were showing. Nice hits there, though. Shoulders. You know, I love shoulders. Super shaky cam, girl. But it's like, I don't like that, the shakiness. Because it's intentional. I like that. The whole bridge kind of formation there is really cool, this whole section. They love that formation though. <laughs> this one right here? It's nice though. You gotta see everybody. I like this part. This part nice. Well, dance break outro. Nothing too crazy sound choreography wise. Enjoyed it. I really liked it. I like the choreography. I like that it's not, because I think with like a villain concept, again, when you are presenting this concept and stuff like that, just how kind of the song shook me up, because I'm like, oh, it's, it's, we're, we're kind of, we're kind of doing this with song boys and stuff. It's all the same thing with the choreography, because I feel like most stuff like this, you want very strong, very sharp knife cut type choreography, but that's not what it is at all. It's kind of bouncy or whatever. And they do have, they do hit their shapes really, really nice and very strong. And it's, it's not very in your face though, but it's, they're just very nice strong hits and stuff like that which is what I like because even the bounce kind of almost bouncier type textures and some of their movements do very much fit the song um which I, it kind of like has to you kind of have to do that because like super sharp knife cut I don't know if that would necessarily that type of choreography would work for the sound that they're going for um but it definitely it works for it and I really really enjoyed it and I did like getting more of that again like that art museum type um 
setup then versus the one with the fire because we got so much of that in the music video and it was gorgeous and I loved it. Then it cuts away here and there so then it gave me what I wanted. Um, and I do like, they do like kind of very, very shaky cam movements, almost like shaky cam how they shoot action sequences. Um, so that was very, very cool to get that. And I think it added a variety to um, the camera movement in that sort of way and stuff. Because um, this one is pretty standard for the most part. I mean, like the push in and outs and all that other jet, just standard high quality camera movements. Um, but again, the shakiness added a nice spice to the, <laughs> to the, um, to the camera work, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. I can't talk today, again, I don't know how to talk. I can't get my thoughts across uh, very well. <laughs> I can't do it today. I don't know what's wrong with me today. Um, but I really did like the choreography. I think it's very, very fitting for the song. And again, it's just like really, really good quality stuff. Like, that, it's, 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 high quality good quality stuff and it's it's not doing too much even again there for the outro with the dance break and stuff like the song doesn't go crazy for that and the choreography doesn't either but it just is giving you a nice quality dance break outro you know what i mean um and that's what i love about it, it it's it's, it's given us quality and it's a very unique type of concept uh, well it's not a unique concept because everybody has the villain concepts and the superpower concepts um and not everybody does but it's been done before uh but what's different is the sound that they go for that is kind of the, the sound that it is, I wouldn't expect it to be with a villain type concept, it, the same thing with the choreography, but it, they both work for each other and it's very nice, very clean movements, very just, just very nice quality, high quality stuff we get from them and I really enjoyed it. Go to for your thoughts and comment down below to that about Drippin's villain, dance or choreography music version of the music, choreography version music video. Your thoughts comes down below if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. If you liked me and you want to see more of my videos, go and hit that subscribe button. If you want to see my videos the second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok, or description down below. Or at the end screen, share this video to your friends. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Love you and I'll tell you guys later. Bye. I'm in